World of Dentistry. Dental solutions for your dental needs. Hello everyone, our YouTube friends. Welcome to our channel. Today, we will answer a very interesting question. How many teeth do adults have? I'm sure many of you have wondered about it. Well, get ready to find out here. Before we go into detail about the number of teeth in adults, we need to know a little more about these amazing structures. Teeth are not only essential for our digestion, but they also play other important roles. They are composed of several layers, enamel, dentin, cement, and pulp. Teeth have various functions in our day-to-day. -day. They help us crush food, thus facilitating digestion. They are also essential for phonetics, allowing us to correctly articulate words and make appropriate sounds. In addition, maintaining a beautiful smile and an adequate chewing function are other important functions. Now, let's talk about how teeth are classified. Depending upon their position in the mouth, their shape, and the function they perform, teeth are divided into four main types, incisors, canines, premolars, and molars. But what about the children? Well, when we were little, our teeth were different. We have primary teeth, also known as milk teeth, during our childhood. They begin to erupt around six months and are complete around two to three years of age. Deciduous teeth consist of 20 teeth in total, 10 on the top and 10 on the bottom. In a child's mouth, we find eight incisors, four canines and eight molars. These teeth have special functions, such as guiding the eruption of permanent teeth and maintaining space for them. As we grow, our baby teeth give way to permanent teeth, which will stay with us for a lifetime. The first permanent tooth usually appears around the age of six, and from then on a dental replacement process culminates around the age of 12. Permanent teeth consist of 32 teeth in total, 16 on the top and 16 on the bottom. These include eight incisors, four canines, eight premolars, and 12 molars. Some of these molars are the famous wisdom teeth, which are often extracted for various reasons. Now, let's talk about the differences between primary and permanent teeth. In addition to the number of teeth, there are other distinctive features. Primary teeth are smaller and appear whiter, while permanent teeth are larger and more translucent. Also, primary teeth do not include premolars and have more space in the dental pulp. No matter what dental stage you are in, it is essential to maintain excellent oral health. Prevention is the best treatment. In fact, tooth loss is a common concern in adults. According to the CDC, 26% of adults age 65 and older have eight or fewer teeth, and one in six adults age 65 and older is completely edentalous. But don't worry, there are steps you can take to maintain good oral health. Here are some helpful tips. Maintain good oral hygiene. Brush your teeth at least twice a day with a soft bristled toothbrush and use fluoride toothpaste. Don't forget to use dental floss and mouthwash for a thorough clean. Adopt a good diet and healthy habits. Reduce the consumption of sugary foods and drinks, since they are the main culprits of dental caries. And if you are a smoker, try to reduce the frequency of tobacco consumption, since it can seriously affect your oral health. Make regular visits to the dentist. Do not forget to schedule regular visits to the dentist every six months or at least once a year. The dentist will evaluate your oral health and perform preventive cleanings and treatments to keep your teeth in excellent condition. Remember that oral health starts from childhood. It is essential that parents make their children aware of the importance of good oral hygiene and take them to visit the dentist from the moment the first milk tooth appears. Good oral habits acquired at an early age will last a lifetime. In summary, adults have 32 permanent teeth, while children have 20 deciduous teeth. Maintaining good oral health is essential to prevent tooth loss and enjoy a beautiful and functional smile. That's all for today. We hope this video has been useful to better understand the today's topic. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more information.